In case you haven't already, don't forget to go on my channel and click that subscribe button and the bell right next to it to never miss a video. If you want to help me out even further, enter the support of creator code enterplays underscore YT at the bottom right of your Fortnite item shop. Enjoy. It's been so long since I've made a Fortnite video. It feels very weird to get on the game again, I'm not going to lie. I haven't played it since Chapter 2 Season 1 properly. Played a handful of games in Chapter 2 Season 2 and a handful of games in Season 3. Even smaller handful this season, only a few. But I'm finally back and making a video on it. Now I don't actually have any current plans to fully come back to this game, but this video is quite unique and I really want to share it with you guys. Basically, a company called 3D Rudder reached out to me and sent me one of their products to review for a video. Now the product is, as you guys can see on the camera, a foot controller. So how it works is you put your feet on the top and you can control your movement in game and you can switch weapons with it as well. This allows you to not worry about clicking WASD on your keyboard and just focus on your building. Now for me, I sometimes accidentally slip and press WASD in like high intensity situations just because I've been playing this game for nearly three years and the muscle memory is just so strong with me. But it's definitely going to be beneficial for a lot more other people. And it still is for me in some areas too. So basically how it works is put your feet on the top. It's going to beep a little bit. I don't know if you guys heard that, it's really quiet. And then you can move in game with it. Lean forward, back, left, right, and then you've got all the bits in the middle too, so you can fully go in all of the directions, and not just those four straight directions. Everything else I'll see you need to do on the keyboard. So that involves obviously one well, and the mouse obviously looking around, picking things up, building and all of that. So I'm just trying a bit of building here with it. I'm just leaning my feet forwards as I build, not having to worry about the movement keys. Now I probably accidentally click D a couple of times during that, because that little building technique is like so deep in my muscle memory that I probably accidentally clicked it. But things like tunneling, for example, just like this, come a whole lot easier just because I'm focusing on my building binds. And nothing else. So this is actually my second attempt at recording this video because I ran out of space on my hard drive. I got a second place 11 kill arena game using this. My hard drive ran out of space and corrupted the file. So basically what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hop back into an arena. I've got a few more points than before. I'm still in open league because I've just played nothing this season. So it should still be very easy and I could very easily get a win. So let's give it a go. I'm gonna go to Frenzy. I used to go there all the time at the start of the season. Not start of the season, I'm talking about start of the chapter. So annoying that this first game corrupted, not getting too much luck recently in these last few games we've been playing. I just need attack. I've been getting charged shotguns and they're so hard to use right now for me. Like, I haven't gotten used to them anyway because obviously the playstyle is a lot different with them. It's so accurate, the movement of this thing. It's very, very well made. Cannot lie. Come on, let's not... There we go. If I missed those last few, I was dead. Literally. Bolt sniper, I'll take it. Let's use this big shield. Do I just want to throw one of these things? Like now? Is that worth just doing that? You see, I just don't have the stuff I need to. Ah, what's that? No, those are crash pads. Two big shields, let's use one of them. What I'm just doing is running at people and spraying, like... <laughs> so easy to just focus on your aim with it though, that's the thing, like, spraying is so much easier with this. I'm not focusing on my movement, I'm just focusing on... where... I'm clicking. I need to push this. There we go. Can still edit pretty efficiently as well with it. Just need a few more materials now. Chug splashes. Okay. 
I wonder why people like this are still unopened. Like, oh, he's just fallen. I spoke too soon. He launched padding away from me. Are you really going to do that? Or is he launched padding on top? It is, it does take a bit of getting used to, but I imagine it'll be very beneficial once I do get used to it. Where is he? See, I'm, I keep finding myself accidentally pressing WASD just because I'm so used to it, obviously. I don't really want to take a bolt if I'm going to be um, like having this much healing here. And I need healing for shield. My building is a lot more... Like, you guys can tell if you see my old Fortnite videos. My building then, it was all over the place. That's just because I'm not used to it. You get used to this thing and it will be beneficial for you. My building was so, like, sporadic then just because I'm just not used to it yet. Like, when I get used to it, it'll be so much better. There we go. He was fighting this guy over here. If I had a bolt, then I'd be able to kill him, but... Got this hunting rifle now. Got to use the footpad here. There we go. Just having to, it's like, that's, that's definitely a challenge. Getting used to like, those little adjustments at the top of a ramp when you're head peeking. That was a challenge during that, but got it down. Managed to get the kill. I and mean, he was just half peeking me, so it wasn't a hard shot. Lights over here. I don't even know what these things are. They drop loot, don't they? I have to push this now. He nearly killed me then, to be fair. I expected him to build more, he was just focusing on damaging me, which actually nearly worked for him. I don't know how much chug splashes do, which is a problem, because I've forgotten. I'll do, okay. to it. I'm just using my keyboard there out of instinct. He's trying to heal in the middle of a gunfight. What are you doing mate? That's not gonna that's not gonna work. <laughs> just gonna box up a little bit now and just wait. Okay. That's a shock. I forgot they were a thing. Let's get into the zone. I need materials. Let's just let's just get some materials around here now. Really liking this so far, I'm not gonna lie. I think it's a completely different aspect of the game. It's not it this is open league. 
hope this guy realizes he's playing an open league. What was that? He's far right now. I'm not. I'm not even gonna challenge him. Um. Well, I'm not seeing anybody. There's a guy. I'm gonna fight up top. There's a guy up above this guy as well. Oh. Can I two piece? Two piece? Got pre fire. Six people left. Twenty four on him. Let's just back up to the zone. I swear there might be somebody in this bush, you know. Yep, there is. I thought I heard him moving about. Wait, I just realised I left the med kits. I'm not going to have enough time to use meds at this stage in the game. Where's that from? There's no way he sat in the bush. Everyone's bush camping. What is this? That guy took so long to die. I'm just instinctively pressing WXD by accident here. I just saw this person over here. Come on, I've got a hunting rifle him. Oh no. Did not mean to do that. He's low on mats. There's no way he'd be building more if he was if he had more mats. I do need his med kit. I do need a med kit. I'm gonna keep using mouse and keyboard unintentionally. I keep using mouse and keyboard now. I need these guys to fight. I'm in the best position, it's not the best health. See, I'm using mouse and keyboard now. I need to not. That muscle memory kicking in. There we go. <laughs> Believe me when I tell you, it is actually quite beneficial for your aim, especially, I found. Building, yes, as well, but your aim, you can just focus on where your crosshair is, and it's so much easier to spray control with it, I'm not gonna lie. Especially when you're like close range using an SMG. I definitely rate it. So I wanna say another thank you to 3D Rider for sending me this product. It's been a lot of fun making this video. Definitely go check out this product. I'll leave it all down in the description. Leave the social media there too for you guys. I definitely recommend it. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys later.